This is horrible. I hate this. As we can tell, I'm in a car. <laughs> this is my first time ever driving alone. So if anything goes wrong, I know I've got a car on camera. Touch wood, nothing goes wrong. I'm just gonna set off because otherwise I will be like chatting my brain off for about a year. There is a bin there. This feels so weird not having anyone with us. Uh, go. Go, go, go. Bosh. In today's video, obviously, as you can tell, it's a drive with me. This is my first time driving alone. It feels extremely suspicious, if that's the word. It just feels weird, like it feels so strange. But I'm trying to just stay calm, chill. I passed for a reason and that is because I can drive. We're gonna be driving over to my local Starbucks. Let's hope I don't ramble, but I probably most likely will. Oh, this is gonna be a hell of a little bumpity bump in the ride. Come on, come on, babe. So I passed my test about a week ago, but I have just been driving with my mom in the car. So this is officially, like I have drove this car, but this is officially the first time I'm driving this car by myself. Rev it. I honestly think learning to drive in one type of car and then getting in another one is like the weirdest feeling ever. I learned in a little mini and I'm now in my mom's Nissan Note. The difference between the cars is absolutely ridiculous. I'm just not a fan of the Nissan. Oh, you can see them behind us. This is too awkward for me. Gotta learn. I've got to do these hill starts in this Nissan Note. Even though I hate it, I absolutely hate it. Don't get us wrong. I've got to do it. I right, hate stopping, so where next? Here we go. Straight over. Stunning. Look at that. Woohoo! Sorry, when I do literally one thing correct, I'm like buzzing at myself. Just let us be, because I'm literally just a girl. I'm just a girl living in my own world. <sighs> and sometimes you've got to reward yourself for the little things to make life worth living. This drive through is so sus to get to, because you have to like go through a petrol station. This is a hell of a spin, I'm definitely going to curve it. Right, I need to have a look at the drinks. Pumpkin spiced. Should I get an iced pumpkin spice latte? Ooh, pumpkin cream cold brew. That sounds like a bit of me. Hi, can I please get the pumpkin cream cold brew? I'm really sorry, we're sold out of cold brew today. Could I get the iced pumpkin spice latte then? Oh, can I get the pumpkin loaf cake please? The pumpkin loaf, yeah, no problem. Yeah. That's everything. Yes, that's everything. Do you want the cream on the iced latte? Um, ooh, a little bit please. Thank you. This feels so strange. I'm sorry, it's just hitting us. Like, I can drive. I can literally drive. As if I've just stalled. That's too much for me. Thank you. Thank you so much. <sighs> I need to move this chair back. I feel like I'm claustrophobic. <sighs> this is getting me proper in the autumn mood. Ooh. Okay, yeah. Wow. Yeah. To be honest with you, if this is what pumpkin tastes like, it tastes very Christmassy. I've needed this though. I've had the shakes all morning. I don't know why I've needed like a coffee. I'd give that, I could do with a little less, maybe one pump or a bigger drink so that the ratio is a bit more equaled out. But yeah, I'd give that a solid like 8.5 out of 10. I'm not gonna lie. This is the sugar rush I need. Guys, look at that. Oh my god. Mmm. That was heaven. Mm. Halloween in a cake. Mmm. Oh, he's flying. Oh, no, he's not. Go, 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 let's go. Go, go, go. Oh, how am I going to do this? I'm going to have to do a big turny win. She best not be stealing my spot because if she is. I'm She's just went and absolutely scooted my flipping spot. Right? Well, you're getting parked right next to her, babe. I hope you know that. Oh shit, I've just stalled. That's what I get for being a loser. Parking skills are not the best, but it is what it is. If anyone wants to park next to us, they get absolutely smacked. Right, I've came to park up in Tesco's because I just need a second to sit. I've decided I'm gonna keep my loaf until I go home. And I've got custard at home. I'm gonna put custard on it and like, and maybe watch a Christmas film. Cause at the minute I've been really into my christmas films don't ask us why bear in mind it's literally october driving this feels like i'm driving a literal cardboard box like it feels so light you can probably feel the wind affecting it whereas in the mini 
minis are like they're meant to be mini like they're meant to be small cars i feel like it's got some like weight to it like every time i was driving it i felt like it was just like a heavy vehicle i don't know if that makes sense but yeah because this one's just i don't know it just feels flimsy I just, i'm not the biggest fan when we talk about insurances though see i was like very much in between do i get my own car or do i just get insured on my mom's car because i do want to move away potentially out of the country would there be a point in me buying a car if i'm just gonna leave and have to sell it no there probably wouldn't be i'm insured for i think six or nine months yeah life's just very up in the air at the minute and i'm just like trying to chill but the price of insurance actually not this sick <sighs> i just wish i had money bear in mind i've just paid 10 pound for a little starbucks but that was an investment let's be real that was an investment i had to have a reason to go drive somewhere to film this video because i wanted to film the video i wanted to film the first oh for flip and sake i'm gonna go over there i'll let us tell him i'm going over there yeah don't you dare stall, Lucy. Let's see. Did I just stall? I've just stalled it. Got the ick. I've got the actual ick off myself. I'm just... Let's see. I've stalled it again. I've stalled it again. Go. Go. More gas. Go on. Yeah. There we go. <sighs> Breathe. I hate things like that. I absolutely hate shit like that. I did all right. Oh, I was meant to go a little. Oh, my God. Gotta go a little to post off a flipping parcel. I feel like my life at the minute is just parcels. I've been on my vintage game, which I'm not complaining about because honestly, the money I've made on vintage may as well start up a business on it at this point. Can I pit that dog? Can I pit that dog? And I'll tell you my story about how my test went because it was quite a trauma. It was an experience, if I do say so myself. Go on, bosh straight out just how i like it this roundabout honestly after about four o'clock especially on a friday is hectic he couldn't pull into there any slower do you want you right you see road rage not needed quick pit stop right here Can have a sip of the pumpkin spiced that is delicious these people are actual idiots what is going on they've got a death wish so we've got this roundabout near my house right and it's had work like getting done on it for about a year i'm not even gonna lie and there's like four ways traffic lights and people just come even if their traffic lights on red they'll just like yeet round and he's just literally done that and nearly like crashed into the car in front of him but i mean he didn't but that's not the point back to my test story you kind of have like a sense when you do your test like how it's going i'm feeling good i've just done like a parallel park nailed that i'm like in a good mood we've got this like hairpin like bend it's like so tight but it joins onto a motorway and then obviously when you get on the motorway you've got to like yeet to like catch up with the traffic bear in mind it was literally peeing it down in rain like i've never drove in the rain and then the day on my test it's literally decided to be a thunderstorm i join onto this motorway oh hurry up old woman i was just running don't run no oh my god i'm gonna tears are gonna come out my eye it's all right don't run um Yes, I'm joining on this motorway. There's a massive van, foot of the floor, getting it in a different gear. It's not speeding up. Car starts making the weirdest of noises. And I'm like, why the flip is this car not speeding up? Like, it's not getting to the speed it normally gets to straight away. Freaking out a bit because the van's like, well, it's like a truck is like right behind us. I go to the examiner. I'm like, why is it making this noise? Like, what, what the hell's going on? And she's like, your clutches just went, I think she said. And so I was like trying to get this car to stay at a speed that's like, what you're doing what we at but obviously the clutch had went so like am i gonna oh shit sorry flip i feel terrible i was too busy talking well the guy behind us didn't let him out either so fairs what was i saying and then we're gonna go into little oh i love little because literally no one parks i'm just got a free range of anywhere i could probably challenge myself and try and park somewhere but am i gonna no i'm really not i'm just gonna pull into the easiest one i see which is gonna be, should I go to the bottom? Yeah, go on then. What was I saying? Car's not speeding up, van's right up my bum. 
lashing it down freaking out i'm like oh my god i've failed i've absolutely failed i literally just turn off in my mind and just go oh pilot i managed to somehow like make it off the motorway safely but in my head i'm like i failed because i just thought that it was me that did that to the car and it obviously wasn't it was just the car like the clutch just went on the car i go back and i'm sat there and i'm like right oh my god this is gonna be another 120 pound down the drain so she gets my instructor in the back and she's like unfortunately and then there's me in my head thinking like shit shit she went your clutch is gone and i'm like oh my god but you did pass and i'm like oh my god why why because i literally nearly had like a panic attack and nearly had a heart attack and i had all type of attacks and she's like yeah because what happened on that like motorway was not your fault and you handled the situation as well as you could have i uh, was just like on literal cloud nine if there's any higher clouds i was on that i was literally just like floating i was like this can't be happening to me but it was and oh my god i came home and i surprised my mom and yeah that was about a week and a bit ago so now i'm free on the road so if you just want to challenge us then screw screw and i'll challenge us yes that's a complete joke that is me being silly goof a goof girl drive safe drive careful I'm going to pop in a little now and uh, drop off my parcel. Um, I might go in and get some cookies as well because I do really need some cookies. It's been a nice little adventure. And I feel like I'm just like, this is a whole new era. It's crazy. Like the amount of YouTubers who I watch, who like do like drive with me. It's happening to me. It's happened to me. Oh my God, I'm just buzzing. Like I'm experiencing this all for the first time. And it's just, you just best believe I'm going to be doing so many like drive with me videos. Excited to be driving and I'm just happy. So yeah, you're going to be seeing my face a lot. Um, subscribe if you want to see more of my face and more videos. I'm going to throw back. I'm going to... I'm going to throw it back. Oh my God, I've just cringed. I'm going to throw it back to old school YouTube. And I'm going to be coming out with like old school YouTube videos. And this is just for me. Like I just get so much happiness out of doing things like that. I feel like no one does them anymore. So if you're a YouTuber or you make videos and you're watching this, please bring back old school youtube videos it's a new season and it's a new me and i'm ready to just explore this and i hope you are thank you so so much for watching if you've made it this far into the video comment a steering wheel or a car and i'll see you in my next video i just don't want to die today what do i nah not a day satan not a day